Let's take a look at using forces to create movement. If you've got a rigid body object such as this one, then you'll need to use a force in order to move it around because it's constantly being controlled by the physics engine in the game. So you can't use a normal kind of translate because it would conflict with the physics on the object. So we can add a force or a constant force uh, in order to move it around. In this uh, module we're just going to look at adding a simple force to the box. So if I stop playing the game and create a new JavaScript, I'm going to call this force and when I edit it I'm just going to create that force in a start function. So I need to address the rigid body and I'm going to say add force capital A capital F and I just need to tell it a direction so I'll say vector 3 0 for X 0 for Y and I'm going to put a variable name into the Z axis and I'll create that variable at the top I'll say var power is a float and is equal to 500 in there oops 500 okay so if I save that go back to unity and drag force onto the box you'll see that it's a component in the inspector and I can adjust the amount of power if I hit play now it will fly forward in its z-axis so following the blue arrow okay so because it's in start that was only applied once but equally you could apply that to uh, a key press or to um, an update so it's constantly running or whatever you want really so that's how you use a force in Unity.